Hey everyone, my name is Hershey and I'm really excited to share uh, some of the tips and ideas that I personally enjoy using uh, when I'm editing my rows in my hub site and I thought it would be great uh, to kind of share these ideas to help make your site more interactive and more beautiful. So the initiative that I'm working here uh, with is Keep Your City Clean. This is just a demo initiative that I've kind of created. And I've added a lot of content into this uh, site already, as you can see. But uh, the background for this particular row, I have kept it really plain and simple as of now. So when I go to edit my row and the row setting opens up, uh, as you can notice, a bunch of options automatically pop up. But what I'm particularly interested in is uploading an image for the background and because this is an initiative of keeping the city clean let me go ahead and add some beautiful stock images that i have downloaded and yes there you go so what automatically happens is the whole image is kind of spread or is kind of uh, extended to the entire extent of the row and it doesn't really look that appealing so what I do now is go to appearance and fix the background. So once I fix the background, the image kind of fits into the row and it's really pretty, but the content can move or you can scroll the content up and down. This way the image is not distorted. It's kind of fixed in its place and it creates a really nice uh, visually appealing effect when someone scrolls down this particular page. The second that thing that I do is increase the transparency of the image. The particular image that I chose is really loud. It has a lot of colors in it. It has a lot of things going on. And that kind of makes the words or all of the content on this image really hard to read or it kind of reduces the visibility. So as I increase my transparency, uh, the, the all of the words and all of the content becomes a lot more visible and it becomes more appealing. Further, you can go and add a background color, which is really nice and a cool effect. So it can kind of add a tint to all of your uh, background image. And it makes sure that you can stay in alignment with the theme of your entire page. So this is a really cool um, effect or this is a really, you know, some tips that you can use to kind of make your entire site really appealing, really beautiful and more interactive. So let me save this. And once we go to view, you can see how this effect kind of plays out. So the image in the background kind of stays in its place where all of the content moves. And I've done that to a couple of other rows as well on my site. And I really, really like this effect. Hope you guys really like these tips. Thank you.